Welcome back to David's Tutorials video series on understanding tabs in Microsoft Word. In the previous video, we covered adding tab stops using the tabs dialog and the ruler. If you missed the previous videos in the series, click here to catch up. In this chapter, we will cover how to move and delete tab stops. You may remember that tab stops are indicated by markers in the ruler bar. A good thing to know about these indicators is that you can move them, and when you do, the associated tab stops will move in your document for the paragraph where the cursor is located. You can also move tab stops for multiple selected paragraphs. To start, I will click to place the cursor anywhere in the first line. Now watch the position of the third letter pair as I drag the tab stop marker in the ruler area. I drag the marker left, the text at that stop moves left. I drag it right, the text moves right. Besides moving the tab stops in one line, you can move them for many paragraphs at once. Simply select all of the lines, then drag the tab stop marker. Here, I am dragging to select all five lines of text where each line is a separate paragraph. Then, dragging the third tab stop marker, notice how all the text elements at the third tab stop move as I drag the marker. To remove a tab stop marker using the ruler bar, simply drag it off the bar. In this example, I will drag to remove the third tab stop marker. Click, drag, release, gone. As you see, there was a fourth tab stop marker at about the 5 inch point. When I removed the third marker, what had been the fourth marker became the third, and all the text elements at the third tab stop moved out to that position. You can also delete a tab stop using the tabs dialog. Select the tab stop to remove and click the clear button, or you can clear them all at once. Note that you cannot move tab stops using the tabs dialog. You can only delete them and add new ones. You should now have a good handle on how to move and delete tab stops in your Word document. In the next chapter, we will look at left, center, and right tab stops.